Welcome, I'm Michael, Michael Beale, NLP trainer and coach trainer and stakeholder center coach. In this segment, we're going to look at what is NLP. It stands for Neuro Linguistic Programming, a bit of a mouthful, um, but the name came as a bit of a joke. Uh, so I'll probably cover that, cover that later. It was created by John Grinder and Richard Bandler about 40, 45 years ago where they studied people who were very good at helping others change and worked out some of the distinctions that the people that were successful at being a catalyst for other people to change, what they had. So NLP is basically about three things. It's about an attitude of curiosity, um, because if you're not curious, you're not going to want to find out. It's skills in modelling. Um, both consciously and unconsciously, as to what other people do that works. And then it's sort of codifying that, translating it into technique, so you can teach what you've learned, so other people can use it to improve what they do. I think that um, one of the things that um, I found quite interesting, though, in learning about modelling... Um, Sometimes to model, sometimes to improve your performance, you have to let go of what you've learned before. Sometimes you can't improve unless you're prepared to forget things that you thought were true in, 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 in the past. So the modeling thing sounds easy, but there may be a little bit more to it than people at first, people at first think. I've been working with NLP for, with people for over 14 years now. And the clients that like it do make step changes in their lives. I am going to make the point, though, it's not per se the NLP that makes the steps change in their life. It's them using it. Um, NLP is like lots of things. If you practice it with good people, you improve. If you don't practice or you don't have good role models, then it's far, far harder. However, the sake of what we're doing during these videos, it is a tremendous enabler to help people achieve whatever it is they want to achieve. Thanks for listening. In the next segment, we're going to look more specifically at what, pe what people have achieved by using NLP. Thank you.